Hi everybody, it's Mr. Gray here. We had such a great first day. It was so fun to meet everyone. We did a lot to try to help to get to know each other again, as well as get a chance for me to get to know the kids and for them to get to know me. I shared a lot about my classroom and myself, so you can ask your kids about that. The only big updates I have um, for the forthcoming week is that I have two forms uh, for your family to fill out. One is for you parents to fill out, uh, and the second one is for students to fill out. That can be found on the email that I sent, also on our classroom website, which has all of these updates um, where you can see them and click on them when you need to. The second one is I just wanted to tell you and give you a heads up about our PE schedule. Um, PE will be Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday. The Friday will be less intense. Um, it'll be shorter with our class. We might be out in the grass and sometimes the grass as well, but it won't be as intense Tuesdays and Thursdays. You can expect a lot more activity if kids wanna dress kind of appropriately for a little more activity on those days. And we know for a few months, it's gonna be really hot too. So I saw a lot of kids with water bottles, but setting some water bottles are a really great idea. The filling station is right outside our classroom. On to some academics. We're gonna get started with Reader's Workshop, our first unit, not next week, but the week after. So next week, we're kind of getting ready for Reader's Workshop. We're gonna review some Reader's Workshop procedures and systems. The kids are gonna to get to know the library, make a shopping list. This weekend, you're gonna get a shopping list at home that your kids filled out and you're gonna to have to talk about it with them and sign them up. That's their big homework for the weekend is talking about their shopping list and what they're gonna read as far as books go for a couple weeks um, going forward. I'm gonna read out loud the story Year of the Dog, um, which is a wonderful way to start the year. And the kids are gonna be reflecting on their own reading, Year of the Dog, and comparing and contrasting those things. For Writer's Workshop, the kids are gonna be doing two things. First, we're gonna start with some pictures the kids are gonna write about. They're not gonna know anything about the pictures. They're gonna to have to construct a story simply based on a picture. And then they're gonna to have to connect it with another student's story. After that, we're gonna move on to just a quick review for a few days about responding to questions about text and video. We're gonna use a something called race responses, which is the structure, a structure you can use to answer questions, but that's um, a great thing to set us up for answering questions in all the subjects going forward. In math, the kids are going to put together a proposal for furnishing a hotel. We're gonna do a project for the whole week. Um, the kids are gonna to have to kind of study about hotels and different layouts. We're gonna actually consult with a design expert and they're gonna to have to put together a proposal for furnishing it. Um, what goes inside the rooms in different kinds of rooms for different sized rooms and put together a pricing list for that and essentially a proposal as if you are presenting to a company saying, I want to be the one to furnish the hotel. This is how much it would cost. This is what it would look like, like that. So they're gonna be working uh, in groups partially and individually partially. For history, we're gonna be working on a project called Who's Coming to Dinner? The students are going to put together a list of people that are famous or that they know uh, that they would like to invite to a dinner. And they're gonna put together not only a little bio on the person to explain why they're inviting them to dinner, uh, but also a menu, uh, in a special invitation, a list of the costs, what entertainment you're gonna do, et cetera. And then they're gonna have to present part of that to the class and also to small groups. Uh, in science, the students are just starting science lab next week at the end of the week. Our science lab time is Thursday and Friday afternoon. Uh, and so that will start next Thursday. And we're not doing any science in class next week, but that will start after that. That's about it. As always, you know, contact me if you have any questions, but we've had a great day so far, and I think we're gonna have a really fun year. All right, bye-bye.